What I saw yesterday was pathetic. Um, I didn't even want to talk about it. Because how come, you know, this is one crack news too. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification button. And for this video, I definitely want to see you guys on the Cash App. <laughs> because this is the one that they are definitely finna jump on my back for. I risk it all every time I make a video. But this is definitely one that they gonna say screw you. So my Cash App is Carcino, K A R C E N O, and away we go. Now, Amber, who enters the wrong apartment, which I believe she did, but as a trained police officer, she fatally shoots and kills a person and then goes, Oh my God, what have I done? She barely helps him. She texts her boyfriend right after. As she's calling 911 so he can get there immediately. And she's not caring about his life. She's caring about her. Her concern was her. And the way she reacted. And she was in the wrong place. And it was just terrible. And what made it worse is how everybody catered to her as she was having such a rough time. When the victim's parents are having trouble sleeping and eating due to the situation. Then the brother of both of them, John. As he's sitting there, he gets up and actually hugs the person, the woman that took her, his brother's life. He hugs this woman as a power of forgiveness. And America's like, oh, this is what I'm talking about. This is, this is what it's about, the forgiveness. Why come... And how come it's always up to us to be the forgiving ones of someone's wrath upon us? But where is it in reverse? Let's say both of them, John, accidentally goes into Amber's home and sees Amber, shoots Amber. He's a police officer, trained. He barely tries to help her out, calls his girlfriend, tells her to come to the spot, called 911 and says, hey, I thought I was in the wrong place. They'll talk about giving him the needle. She got 10 years. How much time do you think Mr. Botham would have had? And do you think Amber's family, who'll be sitting there, is going to jump up and hug Mr. Botham? Where, where would their forgiveness be? You see? And they wonder why people don't trust the system. Now, everybody who's listening know the words I just spoke are true. That's how screwed up this society is. But the law says we are all equal. No one is above or below. Right? But it damn sure don't seem like it do it. So when everybody was celebrating the guilty verdict, I said, nah, let's wait to the sentencing. <laughs> let's kind of wait. 
because I knew some foolery was about to happen. The system will protect who they care about the most. And in this case, they showed you who they think that person is. Anyway, it's your boy Carcino. I'm out.